So, hi again and welcome back. Uh, I'm just where we left off earlier. For me, it's just the blink of an eye. For you, and maybe a couple of hours and maybe a day. It's amazing. The world of time travel. I tell you, it's amazing. Now, what I'm going to do now is I'm going to just make a creative flat world. I don't want structures. I want it to be f super flat. I want to allow chits on. Chits. Chits. And again, Daniel, your English is failing. Quickly. Quickly, it's failing. Hello, sheets on. No, again, I'm just gonna leave that word as it is. CH, you're my enemy. You're my enemy. I don't wanna talk about you anymore. <laughs> there we go. And I'm gonna call it super flat. I don't remember if it's two G's and two S's. So I'm not sure about that either. I'm not, I'm not sure about a lot of things now. Great new world is gonna be amazing. And here we are. Brand new world. A whole new world, a new fantastic point of view. No one to tell. Okay, I'm gonna stop that now. Not with uh, the settings. I'm gonna, yeah, peaceful. That was what I'm looking for. What I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna paste the structure that we left in, left earlier of it, the schematics, and I'm gonna try to take that schematics and I'm gonna rotate it. Ro, ro, right, oh, Jero, owl, and I'm gonna. I'm gonna I'm gonna rotate 90 degrees four times no three times and I'm gonna make the cross and that was what I was looking for it was a cross not a crucifix isn't that a crucifix I'm not sure the crucifix is the one that like longer in one side and then it was a bit anyway so schematic and then we're gonna do load because we're gonna load the schematic file that we left off with earlier and it's called I'm sorry about sniffing temple two yeah no. No! What do they call it? Do they call it, no. do they call it Temple? Temple 2? God damn it. So, yeah, due to the brain and memory of a goldfish, and just some random typing errors, it's also actually called Temple 2. <laughs> just a quick typing error there. I don't know how that happens. A and E is not even close, but I hope it doesn't mean anything sexual or anything. Temple. I never heard of that word. So, press enter. Oh, god damn it, I hell. Oh. I was so sure this time. Alright, so this time I think I have it. I think I've misspelled. I think I've done a typing error and combined it with a Norwegian word for temple. Which is temple. 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 No, I haven't. Yeah, yeah, wait, no, it's the right word. So it's temple too, not tampel, but temple. Temple, le temple, and let the templary wheel itself. Okay, I need to paste it first. Okay, paste. There we go, reveal yourself. Well, this might actually take some time though. Uh, this is the fun with world edit again. The lags, the constant lags. And if you're wondering, you can use this now, it's too late. But if you get these huge world edit legs, it's the perfect time to go up and pat the pat the cows gently on the back. Now I don't really hurt it, but when it lags, you don't hurt it at all. So there you go. That's your uh, that's the temple, and I even got a little bit of bush up there, even a bit of kata bush. Ah, oh, there's more bushes, a lot of bushes. So there you go. That's how you load the schematics into your flat word. Flat word, Jesus. Uh, flat word. World. World. Flat world. There we go. Whatever I said. Uh, and now I've already, since I've loaded the schematics, and I've only pasted it once. Well, I haven't pasted it, but I've loaded it, so it's, it's in my clipboard. So I don't need to load it again or copy this because it's already there. So all I have to do. In theory, at least, I have to just slash slash and then rotate, rotate your owl again. I'm gonna rotate it 90 degrees. So rotate 90 degrees, uh, and now I'm not sure which way it rotates. If it's clockwise or counterclockwise, I would say it has to be. It has to be clockwise, doesn't it? It should be clockwise. should be clockwise. Uh, 
Alright, so now for the sides here, I have kind of an idea what I want, but I'm not really sure yet. So what I've done now is I've just quickly made a really bad tree. So for, no, it's not really bad, but it's it's not perfect. Wait a minute, I don't want this rain. Hey, rain, go away. I nine gold in my soul, soul, come to my... Uh, I'm kind of now... I'm just gonna do like this instead. I've made the tree that I kind of want, and I'm gonna make like... It's kind of hard to explain, actually. I'm gonna make like half circles that goes... It doesn't curve out, like towards me, but it curves in. Uh, and there's gonna be water involved. That's that's all I kind of want, all I kind of know. Uh, so I'm gonna try that now. Uh, and this is kind of, this tree got kind of big, but I think it has to be that big to look remotely okay, to be honest. And then uh, later on, I'm gonna I'm gonna try this out now, and then I, I may have to make sure that the the world tree in the middle here gets big enough, so these guys doesn't look like it's four world trees. This is kind of its its little daughter or whatnot. But uh, again, the world tree can't really be that much bigger than the uh, than the side here. And actually, also. When it comes to Idris Hill, it has, it has, it has three roots, which goes to three different worlds. Uh, I'm not really sure about the name yet. I can, I can take that a bit later. I just have to refresh my memory. So that's the concept here now. Is we got one entrance, and then we're gonna have three different uh, kind of worlds, if you would like, uh, which go out to the sides here. So like. Like a while ago, I was thinking uh, to have, uh, if you see that black sphere down there, we see some shadow. There's, there's a little glitch there, it's blinking here. I think that's because I'm, I'm time-lapsing as well, maybe not the best idea. But I was thinking about having a big circle in the middle here, like uh, to break it up. But now I'm kind of wondering to have uh, circles on the end instead, at the ends of this uh, these temples. So it goes like on this, the tree sides here, it's gonna have, three of the sides are gonna have a big, big round circle, which is kind of be, gonna be like different worlds, you know, uh, to symbolize that. Gotta make it as accurate as possible. I mean, I'm not sure yet, uh, so that's what I'm doing now. But I'll, I'm gonna try, I'm gonna focus now. Daniel, goddammit, stay focused, do what you're supposed to do. And that's uh, trying to break up the sides here, to make it uh, less monotone. A bit, bit more exciting, make it, it blend into the building a bit more. Uh, because now it's a lot of stone and it's very, ooh, very, very... Uh, yeah, it's way too much stone and it's, there's not a lot, enough detail. So I've, I'm gonna break that up. So I'm gonna try that a bit more now.
Alright, so now I think I've made a layout that I can be happy with, with a, at least for now. Might need to do some polishing more. But So what I've done with the, the bottom floor here, well first of all I've added some lanterns on the sides here, because we needed some more some more light, it was too dark, it would just be a spawning area for mobs, and I have to do, I have to do, I haven't done it yet, but I have to do, uh, make that into a chandelier or something. Uh, because that's the bottom side of where the tree is now on the on the next on the second floor, but I'm not sure if I want to have that tree there on the second floor, so I'm just gonna leave it there for now. And then I made a little small recreation area here, uh, some nice benches you can sit and watch and have a peaceful and tranquil mind and just watch the water flow. Little park area uh, because that's what I'm doing now. Like from the outside. Um, it's going to be mostly stone and bricks and uh, not very uh, a very living place other from these trees here. Whereas from the inside it's going to be like a park area. It's going to be nice and relaxing. Uh, a place for peace and mind. So I'm kind of happy with this. I am kind of think I'm going to leave that as it is for now. Maybe do a couple of tweaks to it. I think I'm going to make this area here bigger, easier to get in, like so. But yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm quite quite pleased, quite pleased. Not perfectly happy, but for now it's good, for now it's good. Um, so that's one part done, uh, and then I want to change this part, I'm gonna finish up this now. Finish up this, and for the last, the top floor, I'm not sure if I'm gonna do anything. Maybe I'll just leave it like this now, because I think it's kind of nice to just walk here and can see barely see the treetop down there. Uh, so I'm, I, th I don't think I'm gonna do too much, uh, and also in the fear of overdoing things, I don't think I'll just leave it like that for now. Of course, I'm gonna place those lantern, uh, those glowstones on the side, but uh, nothing else, I think. Now what I wish, I'm, I have to check something out now, while I got it in my mind, and it's that the trapdoors on the on the glowstone here. I know, I never can quite figure if I like it or not. Hmm... I don't think I want it to be like that, because I can't get any uh, another one on this side. Now if I could place one on the bottom here as well, which is not possible, I think I might have put it there, but no, no, don't want it. I don't want it to be like that. No, it hurts too much, it hurts my ass. So yeah, now I'm gonna try to finish this, this up. Uh, try and... I think I'm gonna try to, to move the tree up. Uh, what is that, a couple of four, four steps or something? Four half steps, a couple of blocks up. And then move the tree so it stands like in here instead. Uh, get a bit of distance from this this water wall and the other tree. So yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. Uh, stay tuned for more. Yeah, I'm kind of too lazy to find my own music, so. Uh. So what I decided to do in the end was to, like I said, move the water two blocks up, and then get a tree a bit closer to the to the columns and to the inside of the house. And then I, I don't really know why, but I decided to kind of open up uh, this middle part to the public, so we can actually go down close to the water and see her and maybe sit on the stairs and relax and watch the birds and whatever you want to do. So that's kind of what I uh, ended up doing uh, and what I figured I would work the best. At least that's what I can come up with now. And I'm quite happy with it. I quite like the, the way it looks now. Uh, it's peaceful, it's nice and I like to get some more wood into the building uh, to break down the, the hardness of the wood. And we should, yeah, it was slightly starting to come together, at least the outside. And I also started adding the torches or the lamps, the lanterns on the side here. Um, and I think due to one or two months here, 
I can't put it into night time. Yeah, so it's night time now. No, it's not. It's like constant day, and I'm not sure how to turn it off. But anyway, uh, so yeah, I'm quite happy with it now. The ground will probably be coming. Uh, do, 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 one, two. I think the ground will be coming down here somewhere. Uh, so I have to add another layer of stone just right around this edge. And I'm kind of uncertain this is one of my trials here. Uh, I, I think I need some lighting in between the columns. Maybe not. I have to see when I get the, the lamps on the other side as well, uh, on the inside. But if I need some columns, they're kind of too close to each other. So I can't make them like this. So I'm, I'm not sure yet what I'm going to do about that. Because if I make them like this, it will be come too really close together and I don't like how that looks it's it's too much it's, they're too close to each other uh, so yeah it's there's a lot of thinking but I think uh, <laughs> oh, there's a lot of thinking but I think yes yes I think a lot yes I think a lot yes I think a lot uh, what was I gonna say yeah I think that's that for this episode uh, I think I'm gonna leave it um, with that now in the meantime I'm gonna try to pretty up these columns uh, and get an idea of how it's going to look inside and then the next round up, next episode, we're gonna try to finish up well a quarter of the build here on the inside as much as I can and uh, hopefully at the end of next episode we're able to copy everything around and then start thinking about uh, Yggdrasil in the middle, the big tree in the middle and then for a final episode, I'm probably going to make the interior of the build, which I do not looking forward to. I'm not looking forward to that at all. But that's it. Thank you for watching. Uh, like, dislike, subscribe, comment. Any feedback is good feedback, guys. So thanks again for watching and uh, have a nice one. Yeah. See you soon.